I'm Clay Pedersen, Managing Director for Agamiora Florida and Wildwood Florida. Today I want to explain the Super High Density System, or SHD, and why it has proven to be a more efficient way of growing citrus. In the last 25 years, high density production models proposed and promoted by Agamiora have developed in Europe and in other countries throughout the world. These are based on hedge management in olives and almond trees, and more recently in prunes, hazelnuts, and citrus. For citrus, the first experimental and commercial groves were planted in Spain a little over a decade ago. Other major production areas that have SHD systems for mechanical harvest and citrus are Brazil and now here in the United States. Growers today are facing lower prices, decreasing yields, and increasing production costs. The SHD system promotes efficient and sustainable production practices that take into consideration inputs such as labor, water, fertilizer, and pesticides. Planting trees in a super high density model offers various advantages. These include reducing the unproductive period by reaching full production quicker, minimizing dependence on labor, and increasing efficiency in hedging and harvesting by utilizing over-the-row equipment. The recommended tree spacing for a SHD citrus grove ranges from 12 to 14 feet between the rows and 4 to 5 feet between the trees. This is equivalent to planting densities of 622 to 908 trees per acre. The rows should be planted in a north to south orientation. This north to south orientation, along with the shape of the hedge, maximizes light interception. Today we are in Lake Placid, Florida at Lost Lake Groves. This is a 12 acre block planted in May of 2018. There are two scions and two different rootstocks that give a total of four combinations. The scions are Vernia and Valquerius LT and the rootstocks are US897 and UFR06. The trees are at 12 foot by 4 foot spacing with 908 trees per acre. Plants used for a SHD system should be grown on dwarfing to semi-dwarfing rootstocks and without central leaders. The use of micro-propagated rootstocks in Agrimiora's smart tree format, like those grown here at Lost Lake Groves, are ideal as they provide genetic uniformity, adventitious roots, and sanitation advantages. Another important component of a SHD planting is hedge management. Hedge management is based on small trees and a two-dimensional continuous hedge made up of multiple branches that should quickly fill the gap between the trees. Once planted, forming the hedge is quite simple. Pruning is fast and efficient and is done mechanically. The tree should be skirted to two feet from the ground and hedged at to a three-foot width. The tree height can depend on which harvester is used, but generally is kept to nine to ten feet. Although the SHD concept was designed for fruit grown for processing or juice, growers quickly realized it also has many advantages for fresh production. Although the fruit is picked by hand, the efficiency of harvest is greatly increased. Also, with the better light exposure due to the canopy structure, the fruit quality is improved. Super high density plantings offer growers a new method of production that reduces labor dependency, a rising concern in all sectors of agriculture. SHD hedges also lower input costs for growers while increasing yield. The super high density concept offers growers the most sustainable system. The system has small, efficient canopies to control the use of inputs and accelerate production dates while preserving or improving quality standards for the product. Simply put, this system offers a great opportunity for transforming sectors for some of the most significant woody species with requirements that are aligned with the needs of today and more importantly, the future. To find out more details, contact Agramayora today.